Now we're going to add some uh, lights to the scene to uh, make it uh, fit more in the surroundings. Uh, so go to create tab, standard lights, and uh, create a uh, target direct. Here in the top view, drag and let go, and then right click and uh, R and scale this up. View, lift it up, lower this, and lower the brightness up. There, maybe. Okay, I go to the settings, on shadows, on area shadows, and let's make a test render. It. I uh, need to add some. Uh, more light to this I can see so uh, I'll add a skylight cost shadows drag that down to 10 maybe it will take a longer time for it to render now the skylights are pretty slow but uh, it is looking much much better the the hole is a little too light S but uh, the particles are looking good yeah and uh, this I'm only looking at the hole the parts you can see through the hole uh, will render out in a different path and then we can color correct that pass in the passes individually. So I think uh, lowering the multiplier to maybe 0.67 and uh, yeah, lowers also the rays per sample, and then hit render again. And uh, I think uh, this looks good. So, now I am going to render out uh, the hole and uh, the particles. So, uh, okay. I'm going to select everything, all these two, uh, the backgrounds, and right click object properties, renderable. And uh, I will also uh, select the table leg press object properties and uh, renderable so now uh, then press 8 and uh, deselect this map so I'll test it again and see how it looks here's the alpha channel and uh, this is the hole that we're going to use so maybe I'll darken the whole texture a bit uh, if I go there I can uh, I can even uh, scroll down and uh, use this texture as an instance. So this is for the particles then, and then this is only for the inside of the hole. So then make this uh, dark and then go down to maps and uh, decrease that. It will make it darker. So uh, now let's see how that looks. A little better, and uh, here's the alpha channel with uh, some uh, small uh, uh, shadows. Okay, then uh, we are ready to render out the entire sequence. So go to render setup, active time segment, uh, view camera, your uh, output size files and then uh, go to uh, make a file or make a new folder maybe and call this the
saved as a PNG sequence. Save. Okay, alpha channel. And uh, now it's time to render. So I'll uh, be back. <laughs> 